things that we realised with my father was that it was all about loss, uh, the loss of his home, the loss of his car, uh, the loss of activity and the loss of interactivity with other people. So when I had the opportunity to get involved in VR and to see what that could do for elderly people that were in care, I really wanted to contribute something that would make a difference to people's lives. So what we noticed over time was that even some of the, the nicest facilities were very comfortable. Uh, everything was about comfort, but there wasn't enough fun, there wasn't enough joy, and that's where uh, we as a, as a VR company saw an opportunity to bring that fun and, and to bring that joy to those that have limited mobility, some that can't leave the, the residence or even leave their room. Well, I think since we've been having um, solace at the boulevard, we've seen residents really joyful. They um, have engaged in activity that you maybe wouldn't expect an older person to enjoy, but we've seen um, people responding to um, travels overseas, to ice caps, to the beaches, and they're really able to share it with their families and with the staff. So far we've had some really good results here at the Boulevard and putting together all of those uh, positive responses is pushing our case to being able to roll this out. I just love the interaction with the residents when using it. Their descriptions have just been unbelievable. Can't imagine so much scenery in such a space. Thank you.